Have you ever wondered how to turn a simple list section in Squarespace in a sleek tagline? Well, you are in the right place. In today's video, I'll guide you how to create a sleek timeline in just few simple steps by adding custom CSS and JavaScript. So let's get started. Head over to the section where you have added your list. Now, depending on what elements you want to show, you have control here. Toggle on whatever suits your design. And for this tutorial, I'll turn everything on so you can see how versatile it can be. It's completely up to you. Now let's add some content over over to the content. As you can see, few items already have been added. You can add it by clicking on add and you can fill in the items, whether it's date, events, any timeline details you can customize as you want. Next up, let's go to the design. Set the alignment to the center for a more polished look. Now we will limit the max column to two. This will give it a balanced, clean structure. Also toggle the image crop to circle for a more modern professional feel. If you prefer square images, you can turn off the crop option, but I find that the circular images really elevate the design. Now let's head to the size and space. This is crucial for getting that timeline feel just right. Set the layout width to full for a seamless look across the section. Next, adjust the media width to around 35. This will ensure that your images don't overpower the next but are still prominent. Set the media placement to the center. For content width, make sure it's large so the text isn't cramped and keep the space between items and elements small for a tight organized layout. Lastly, for the vertical padding, I recommend keeping it small so the timeline has a smooth flow and position should be equal. Once you have set everything, hit save. Now it's time to add some code to really transform the layout. Let's open the custom CSS I have got the CSS ready for you. Copy the CSS code and paste it in the custom CSS section. As you can see, we have a basic structure over here. Through CSS, you can change the color of the timeline as well. Click on save. Now to add the interactive part, we will need to insert some JavaScript. Head over to the code injection and paste the JavaScript in the header and click on save. And that's it. In just few simple steps, you have added a simple sleek timeline using this section in Squarespace. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more Squarespace tricks and tips. I will see you in the next video.